Whew. Nothing like a good four by six to wake you up in the morning, eh? <laughs> so I was asked to share with you what we do in missions. When I was asked, I laughed out loud. Because how can I tell you what we do in six minutes, right? Doctors George and Hazel Hill, you have paved the way for Victory Missions all around the world, and I am blown away by the many facets of what we do in missions. And I love that about Victory. We're not just one isolated stream, we're multifaceted. And we are certainly using every available means in many creative ways to get the gospel of Jesus Christ to the nations. Now I wanna play with uh, just a quick video clip for you. It's a video, it was put out last June for the International Day for the Unreached, but I really liked it. Um, it's gonna show you some numbers. These are not victory statistics, these are global statistics, okay? And I liked it because it gives you a picture of the immensity of the mission that we're on. And uh, it's how we as victory, how we are gonna fit into this global, uh, the global missions and the impact that we're going to be making on the nations. We'll go ahead and play that. Living and breathing on this earth right now. 2.5 billion have never had a chance to hear about Jesus. 70,000 of them die each day without the gospel. Yet, on average, the church spends less than 1% toward reaching the unreached. Do we care? Does this break our hearts? Or does it unite us? motivate us to take action. We will take the stand. We won't stand idly by as people enter eternity without Christ. With boldness, we will obey the commission to go no matter how distant or different. We will build bridges until every village, community, and city hears and knows the choice to follow Christ is theirs. We have the talent, resources, people, the passion, and we will not stop until all have heard the love of Christ for them. And on this day, we unite. 2.5 billion. You guys, these numbers astound me. That's not okay. One part of me looks at that and I'm so overwhelmed with the immensity of the mission. But then another part of me is, let's do this. Let's get this thing done. We're victory. We see a problem and we go out and we solve it. This is not okay, and, but we are gonna do something about it. Now I could spend weeks telling you about all that we do as Pastor Dion showed you, uh, <laughs> but uh, I don't want to share with you just a bunch of facts and a bunch of information so that you can be informed. I want to share with you so you can be a part. And we are a vital part of reaching these 2.5 billion people with the gospel of Jesus Christ. Not only because we're Victory Family and that's what we do, it's in our DNA, right? But also so that you can catch God's heart, not just for your Jerusalem, but for the nations. I want you to be a part because every tribe, tongue, and nation has to hear. So what better way for you to gain an understanding of what we do than to go yourself, right? To see firsthand, meet these people face to face, because when you meet them face to face, they're not a number anymore. They matter. God loves them so very much. So we are gonna provide you with two opportunities every single year to go on a missions trip. And the first one is gonna be geared more towards our youth. So they'll be able to come to the Victory Village, they get trained up for a week, and get baptized in the Holy Spirit. And then they're gonna be sent out, and it'll be a trip led by Pastor Dion Malloy. And their first one is gonna be in August of 2020 going to Cuba. So gather up your youth groups, have them come, and uh, be a part and get out there uh, and be part of this mission. And the second one is going to be more geared towards adults. And so in 2020, the fall of 2020, uh, Dan Nichols is going to be taking that, that trip out to Ethiopia, which is super, super exciting. So go, go firsthand, be the hands and feet on the ground 
to support, to build up our victory, our victory family all around the world, right? We want to support them and build them and be a part of what they're doing as well because we're family and we need one another. And the great thing about these trips is that you don't have to do all the legwork to make it happen. You get to sign up, show up, and be a blessing. It's super easy. So come on, let's, let's get out there. You won't regret going. If you've never been, you need, you need to go. So what do we do in Victory Missions? We change the statistics. We're about our father's business. We, he said to go, and we're going, right? Every available person, any available time, every available means with the gospel of Jesus Christ till every tribe, tongue, and nation will hear.